I hear you. I get comments from all of you so often about your thinning hair and what to do. What's the remedy? Well, I have found that wigs are a big remedy for me, but there are some times that go through the same problems that maybe many of you do. And that's when it's really hot in the summer, like in, you're in Texas or Florida or someplace that the heat is just unbearable. And so then, you know, wigs can sometimes be hot, especially if they're longer and they're on your neck. I know personally. And so many of you said, well, what's a solution to that? And many of you have menopause and are going through where you have hot flashes. Mel B, how do I work that in with wigs? And then the other thing is, is that you want gray, real gray human hair topper so that it's, no one's going to know. No one's going to know. And guess what? I have one of those. Unit Wigs has sent me a topper that is so lightweight, hand-tied, human hair, gray, salt and pepper, gray topper. And so I want to show you something that I think is going to be a huge hair remedy in the way of helper hair just for you. I'm first going to show you, you the topper uncut. And I'm just going to wear it. I'm going to put it on so you can see what it looks like. And then for you to be able to see and envision and talk about ways that you're going to get it styled and cut to fit your hair. And then I'm going to show you what after I've trimmed it and styled it, what it looks like on me. So I hope you enjoyed today's video. Let's get started. Let me show you what I do. This first time, I'm just going to line this up with my hairline. I'm going to push down on it and then I'm going to take the back comb. I'm just going to scoop it just gently where it's grabbing some of the hair. This side here, scoop it. Push, you can hear it clip on this side. Push and clip. And here, push and clip. Clip, you heard, heard that probably. So, this was right out of the box. It has not been trimmed or styled. It doesn't come styled because they don't know what your style is when you get your topper. They're usually, if it's long, it's just going to be cut straight all the way around. If it's short, they have all these different links in it. And that's so that you can go in and have it. Say you have short hair, they're going to be able to trim it right and fade it into your shorter uh, at the nape of the neck and around so maybe your hair is shorter on the sides they can cut this all the way around and trim it this is so lightweight but there's so much hair on this little topper and it's human hair and gray medium gray i think this will solve a lot of my silver gray sisters uh, problems maybe your hair is a little bit longer well, this, you know, this is just going to give you a shorter look and maybe with your longer hair out, just giving it a nice little shag look. But yeah, with it being your hair is shorter, this is going to be the perfect little topper to pop on, giving you a lot of volume and run out the door. So for all you silver sisters that have said, Mel B, where do I find a gray topper? Where do I find a human hair topper that's gray? This is it. This is from Uniwigs. And yes, this is not a wig. This is a topper. Look at all of the volume. And y'all ladies have seen my hair. Matter of fact, let's just take a look at it. I haven't cut the lace on it yet. So I'm just going to unbuckle it, unclip it like that. I want to pull it up gently, just like that. This is a topper, and it even worked with my silver, silver hair. And see how all this flat, lifeless top I have, because this hair is too, it's just too fine, it's too thin, it won't hold a curl, I can't bump it up, I can't get any volume on it anymore. I've got, you know, some still volume around the fringe, around the bottom of my hair, but not the top of my hair. So if you have that problem, a topper like this is going to be able to get you back a really great style without a lot of weight, without 
without heating you up. And you see this, this is a lace top. So it's still open, it's gonna breathe. And it's just right here for the top of your head. You can see here the coverage that you're going to get. It's lightweight, it's human. All of this is, is hand tied and it's so easy to put on. So what I'm gonna do, what I do, let me just comb this back here. I have all the clips open and I'm gonna take it and first I'm gonna match it up to my hairline. It's so lightweight. I'm just gonna put it in place like that and I'm gonna hold on here on the top and then I'm gonna start with this one in the back. I'm gonna clip it. I'm just kind of scooping, you know, whatever little bit of hair, what hair is right there. It comes with a couple other clips. So if you wanted to put clips in the front, you can. If you wanted to, there's these, this type of wig grip that also would fit underneath and give you a stabil extra stability. Or you can, once you've cut this, you can use roll-on glue right under here and it's going to hold it down. We're going to trim this off right to match the little bob that I have. But now look at all of that volume. Look at, look at it. Look at all of this volume. That for me is amazing. So you can wear it off your face like that. You can bring it down for a more side swip look. The topper you're looking for, you wanted something silver, you wanted something gray. This is a, this is it. This is the one that's going to be able to be able to have something that you clip on every day. And ladies, this does not, is not uncomfortable. It's, it's just, I don't even hardly know it's there. It's certainly lighter than any of my wigs. <laughs> I can tell you that. And yeah, I'm just really tickled pink. I wondered how, what it would look like when I took it out of the box you know, because it, it almost looks kind of like a toupee or something, right? It looks like, you know, what we think of men's toupees and things. But the way this is, and the way that I can make it go in with my bio hair, giving me all this volume and natural. And I showed you the wig line. Did I show you the wig line? So see how some of these, there's a few dark ones right here. I'll probably that seem like they're not in with the hairline. If you have a couple like that, I'm just going to pluck those out. If you stick around, I'm going to go cut the lace and I'm going to trim it to my bio hair and I want to come back and show you how it looks. Okay, let's go put her on. Here she is, trimmed. And I used a, as you saw, I used a airbrush on her just to get a bit more volume on it. And then you can see just how wonderful a human hair topper can be. Because of the feeling, because you can use products on it, you can use hairspray on it. But I do advise when you're doing it, if you're using a blow dryer, or heat heating products is use a use a heat you know heat protectant on it for sure and let me just turn around I trim my hair so hopefully there's not a lot of little white hairs all over the back of my neck I tried to do the best I could to clean it up so let's take a look at the sides and the back
So a nice angled bob for me. I think it'll be a lot of fun to see what you ladies come up with when you get your human hair topper from Uniwigs like this. And I would love to see what you do with yours. So there's still so much more I'm going to be able to do with this topper. I can do a braid down the front here and back. I can do all the cute little, all the cute, you see them on YouTube, all the cute short uh, hairstyles that come with having a thick natural bio hair. But now I'm going to be able to do it with Uniwig's topper. I'll probably do some more videos in the future, maybe like 50 ways of gray <laughs> with my topper. Who knows what I'll come up with, but I hope I'll see you here in the next video. Doing my darlings. Bye.